We're coming to you live from Stairway to Heaven Arena in beautiful downtown Purgatory. And it's a long way to the top if you want to rock and roll. Hey, who just turned you into some generic classic rock DJ dipshit? That's the best you can come up with for an intro? How about a nice simple, here's the fucking kickoff. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Galaxy Chaos face off against the Full Metal Mayhem. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If you like your cocktail cold, your soup hot, and your steak still mooing, then you're gonna love seeing mutants knock cold, their brains turn into hot lava soup, and their bodies strewn about the field, lying still and barely moving. MFL game day is on the air. Oh, you just made me hungry, Grim. I'm gonna go get some of them extra crispy mutant finger strips. Hey, get me a full slab of broken mutant ribs while you're there. <laughs> Slipped away like a grease. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Oh, mama. Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Play by the defense results in an interception. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Oh man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Grim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. I don't think the funeral expenses, that is. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. My parole off. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. <laughs> and that'll be second down and four. And the ball is lateral to... Oh, with the brain scrambler. Third down and five. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 70 
27 to fight it. And it's first and ten. He broke free and has open field in front of him. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. The receiver didn't stand, and there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. Yeah. And it's first and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. He is fighting for every off. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. First and two. Spike the offensive water with strawberry fields. And now they can taste sound, but can't remember what the concept of time is. Second and three. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting or dead. <laughs> Third down and, well, good luck. And into the end zone for a touchdown! Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. the extra point attempt. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. And he picks up ten on that run. Man, he nearly broke that one open, Bricks. Yeah, and I nearly married Trim Big Assian. And I nearly did not crap my pants earlier. Nearly as overrated, Grim. And that's another pick. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. 
sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with the uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. He zings it in there for a four-yard gain. Second down and six. Oh, man, what a throw. That sonic blast just cleared the field. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Nice pass. That catch is good for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. And like Rex's bowels, he is loose and heading for the Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. <laughs> the home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> First and ten. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. Second down in a very lot. And he picks up maybe four on that play. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. The teams are all tied up at the end of quarter one. We'll be right back. Third down and eight. And he's off to 
the races. He's at the party. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the MFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And one saver there. The ref calls a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. First down in a mile. Put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? You ever have a bottle of hot sauce shoved up your ass? Quite the description of that painful hit, Junior. Huh? No, no, it's it. The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Do us something we don't know, genius. Second down and more than the QB would like. Chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. And the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one time thing. Running like a moose right now. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, Who's next? The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. It's a six yard. I ate a piece of licorice once and got a shot like that. It wasn't licorice, you idiot. It was the frank cords of the leaf blower. Well, it was a red cord and it looked like licorice. The point is, ah, I forgot my point. And that'll be second down and four. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. lost their last quarterback next time their offense comes out on the field they will have to forfeit the game that previous play never happened because the defense called a time warp dirty trick and transport their offense back in time it's just a jump to the left and a step to the right oh man he just crushed him <laughs> I gotta see that again. I had a kid once like that walking down the sidewalk, texting with his earbuds in. Freaked him out. He said, hey, what'd you do that for? I said, I did you a lesson. What lesson, he said? That unless you're a baboon with big baboon balls, you gotta pay attention. Yeah, I love it. And I've had it. I'm pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? 
And it's first and ten. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. First and ten. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Oh, big catch, big run, big touchdown. Yeah, big deal. Mr. Meat for Brain Man with a ball and didn't fall down. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. <laughs> Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. And it's first and ten. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody else coming. Oh! when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have to made it the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> <laughs> and it's first and ten. And they call a ginormous dirty trick. If you don't hear it coming, it'll knock you right on your head. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about... And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this win. And it's first and ten. That's a gain of seven yards on the catch. Nicely done. Second and three. And there's another pick. And this quarterback must have learned. Oh, that was a hit. You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? I'll take the salad, Steve. Wait, where am I? And it's first and ten. Second down and long. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out in the field, they will have no running plays. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot. One. Hot. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. Well, it's all fun and games until he tries break dancing. Yep, but skeletons, it's always more let him out. Don't make any mistake.
strikes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the line, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Just got crushed. In your bank, <laughs> and it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QV is using, but can we get him some... He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. And the defense gets another pick. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, the full metal mayhem rocked today and destroyed their opposition. They win by forfeit. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. How was it Scrambles tomato soup? I forget, but a good scab tastes like bacon. Now I know. Mm-mm, a scab lettuce tomato sandwich. Sounds like a picnic. And the MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.